I heard that Lee here at Lee's Gaming Corner wishing you a happy new year for 2021 and after about four or five months I'm not 100% sure I'm back on the grind with um, Minecraft I seriously had a burnout with Minecraft to be fair that's the reason why there's been no uploads of any kind on the channel four months ago I think four or five months ago was the um, car mechanic simulator but we can't do right not too perfectly so for obviously we crack on with the Minecraft series was thinking of doing a um, new new world but I said no we keep this one we struggle with this world <laughs> as We'll probably see over the coming episodes so you know, obviously not much going to be happening since it's actually the first time I actually logged into this world since um, I stopped playing and going from there so if you like this kind of episode don't forget to leave a like, comment, subscribe, push the bell notification so you don't miss any upcoming videos and without further ado let's get cracking on so this episode is just going to be a quick go over everything we've done in the previous episodes, so there'll be no building of such in this episode. Just a little go round of what I've done so far and everything like that. So, just uh, state the obvious here. You may know I'm on the vanilla texture pack, it's just the fact of I'm having problems with the texture pack since its last update and all of that. And I thought, and to be honest, I couldn't be bothered to try and sort it out again. So Stay the true and faithful one of the video one as it's working perfectly fine. And so, as if you actually watch the other video clips on in this world, you may have noticed think about five or six um, episodes we put this real room for the sign of the video. Well, I have actually decided to change that now as me personally didn't think it was working I had a few signs up but so I've decided to for the moment to actually stop doing that get rid of all the signs so we've got a blank canvas here so the next spot here is actually my um, living quarters to be fair a bit bland in here but obviously over time in the next few episodes probably try and think of a way of just exciting making this a bit more exciting than what it is at the moment as it does look a bit bland in here due to the texture pack that I'm actually using so eventually over time I'm gonna sort things out and get on with it but yeah this is my living quarters here that's without further notice let's actually get to the next spot that we actually um, created so the next spot here we've actually um, built myself a little farming area, well, farming area, animal pens, for. there was some pigs in here but I may have been a bit overkill with them, there's some, obviously left the cows here, sheep and there is a chicken, couple of chickens in here, probably we've got to do something about to collect the eggs here I think to be fair. But again, that's a project I could do in the upcoming episodes. And obviously, we've got sheep here. This area here is where I've got some bone meal. I can actually clip some dye along around here. That's the reason why it's blank there. So, collect some flowers. And over here, I've got my little tree farms. I've got my birch wood. This is oak with a creeper sitting right there. This is where it all collects too. More sides here. Haven't managed to get myself some um, dark oak, but I've got some acacia wood here. I haven't found a jungle yet, so I can't put jungle one in yet. But I've got a design a little bit better, to be fair. As these eggs will be growing on this side here. They won't grow because not enough space for them. Also adjacent to that we've got the farm area, storage area for it. 
<coughs> we've got our potatoes, wheat, carrots, beetroot, and all of that going along. Could put a gate on here, so enough for some reason. But we touched up in a few episodes of time. These are storage areas I used just so when I was actually mining out all this area here, I'd have somewhere to place them for the time being. So that's a little farming area and tree farm. Not too bad, I don't think. So here we've got our little enchantment table here. <coughs> enchantment area with books and all that. You'll see how enchantment works. We've got my de-chant, the de -chant, de chanting repair and de the table. Some armor or something I'm never going to use, but I can get claim the um, experience from it. Obviously, we've got our anvil here. Probably need some more soon. And I thought I had. Obviously, I haven't. Got to put something to put storage of stuff. So that's the enchantment room. Does look a bit off center here, doesn't it? So I'll probably at some point, if I'm able to. Yeah, probably go block that way. Again, that's something we could do in the, in an episode. Really? So that's the enchantment room, as I said. On to on to the next area. So here we've got actually got one of our my main storage area of all the blocks in place and everything like that. Probably gonna have to extend it soon as I'm gonna start running out of space soon. But I'm not drastic for it for it at the moment. Here we've got some glowstone dust. But basically everything I I need to that I possibly need. Books and all all the way around. So not looking too bad I'd say what I've done so far and then probably when this fills up I'll go down block if needed so anyway that's the storage room that I've actually built just a simple manual one so here actually see I've got my skeleton spawner here everything I've designed it quite well again it would look better if it was the old texture pack, but other than that, it's not too bad. This is a random block I've got to get rid of at some point. But I did have a bit of an accident with the zombie spawner. For some reason, I think probably over here is when the creeper spawned. I almost actually doing something and decided to appear. Obviously, you put the chest into collect things. But if we get some dogs, they're quite handy because the dogs will eat raw meat as well, so they got de down here. Okay, experience points. Drops the um zombies go down. Again I've just got don't know if I put that in here but I did. It's just random drops they drop and quite handy because you get those bones here so you can make some bone mule. Again another one of these um repair de chanter. They both drop into a double chest there, I can pick it up there and place it in place. So quick grab that, put that back in there so it's sixty four hours. Chest I can actually So that's the little area that I've done so far in my work this area so this is the end area what you can tell the downside about it is I've got to find some endermen I've got to find a never fortress which I'm doing I was having trouble finding so I can actually make some ender eyes so I can actually visit the end but until then I can't actually do that but so that's the 
end portal area. So I'm going to leave it there for this episode. I'm just going to go, as I said, it was just a little show of what we've done so far before I stopped recording. And this is what I'm going to be doing now as by well carrying on with the series. So I do hope you've enjoyed. Let me know in the comments down below. Thank you very much for watching. As that'll be the video. Happy New Year, and I'll catch you in the next episode.